L'accompagnamento musicale è affidato alla fanfara dell'undicesimo reggimento bersaglieri della 132esima Brigata Corazzata Ariete di Orcenigo Pordenone, diretta dal sergente maggiore Luigi Vicedomini. For Colonel Matthew Gomlock, the outgoing commander of the United States Army Garrison Italy, we give you thanks. We're grateful for his wit and wisdom, his challenging leadership, his professionalism, his dedication to the mission of the Vicenza military community. for her devotion, dedication, and tireless efforts on behalf of the soldiers and the families of US Army Garrison Italy. A single red rose is also being presented to Colonel Gomlach's daughters, Penelope and Eliza, a bouquet of yellow roses to Mrs. Kathy Horrigan. The color yellow symbolizes the bright future of her tenure with the community and symbolizes a warm welcome to her from the US Army Garrison Italy team. At this time, the official party is moving forward for the traditional passing of the colors. The history, traditions, and accomplishments of the organization are embodied in its colors, and with the transfer, the organization's legacy is passed as a building rock for future performance and achievement. Command Sergeant Major Dion will pass the organizational colors to the outgoing commander. In turn, Colonel Gomlach will pass the organizational colors to Mr. Mice, signifying the relinquishment of command. Mr. Mice will then pass the colors to Colonel Horrigan, signifying the trust and confidence that the United States Army Installation Management Command and Income Europe has in Colonel Horrigan. This exchange also signifies that Colonel Horrigan is now the commander of US Army Garrison in Italy. Colonel Horrigan will then pass the organizational colors back to Command Sergeant Major Dion. This really is a significant event for the Vicenza military community, uh, and that includes our Italian hosts. We've been incredibly fortunate to have the leadership of Colonel Gomlack for the past two years. Senior civilians, commanders, command senior enlisted leaders, distinguished government officials, community leaders, family and friends from the Vicenza and Darby military communities, thank you for joining us at this very special ceremony. It's a very important occasion and you humble and honor us with your presence today. On their critically important strategic role, serving as the Army's power projection platform south of the Alps. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in a round of applause for these great garrison employees for all they do. This is the best garrison in the United States Army. And it's a testament to Matt's leadership and all the teammates that he has and this great team that he's built. L'Italia è anche un paese di grandissimi scrittori e immensi poeti. Per non fare torto a nessuno, preferisco restare umile e citare invece un cantante di pop. Nelle parole di Cesare Cremonini, c'è qualcosa di grande tra di noi. I feel the same way, largely because of the time I spent with family, teammates, colleagues, friends and community members from Vicenza and Pisa. You've all made me a better leader, a better officer, and a better human being. Thank you. Ready garrisons for a stronger Europe, and we are the Army's home, south of the Alps. Signore e signori, distinti ospiti, buongiorno a tutti. È un grande piacere essere con voi. In questa bella mattina di estate, nella stupenda città di Vicenza. What you do truly makes a difference for both the soldier, the civilian, as well as their family as they come and leave Italy. La nostra partnership è forte. Sono certe che insieme faremo grandi cose. I want to thank everyone for attending, and I'll leave you with just one message uh, from my predecessor. Una comunità. Grazie e buona giornata a tutti.
Sir, this concludes today's ceremony. Take charge of the garrison. One community.